infectious tunes emitted from musical instruments across the island on Friday morning as St. Lucia's music fraternity celebrated St. Cecilia's Day in style. Our camera crew stopped to capture the appreciative crowd at the corner of Pena and Marianne streets near the Central Bakery. Locked off from traffic, with a stage set up for both musicians and artists to perform, while bystanders swayed to the musical stylings of the various musicians. Proud of it, proud of it, proud of it. Yes, she yes, is here, right? Represented man. This time honored tradition, organized by musician and owner of Steve's Barbershop, Stephen Augustine, has continued for many years, both with and without the support of authorities, thanks to Augustine's deep love for music and tradition. Steve's Barbershop is doing the best ever since the years. Yeah man, we have uh, quite a few artists from morning. Yeah. So right now we're gonna have, have uh, well we had jazz on stage and we have about, we have seven, we have about six more groups to come on stage. Oh man, we are about this getting better yeah, day by day. Yeah, it's getting better. Every year it's getting better. So uh, I, I welcome the artists who come so, so far from now. Well, so Cecilia as well is my life. You know, because I've been following that since for over 25 years. You know, so it's all about the music, so that's why I've been following it. St. Cecilia, virgin and martyr, whose story blends history and legend, lived in Rome during the 2nd and 3rd centuries. She is revered worldwide as the patron saint of music, musicians, and singers. This year, St. Lucia is taking it one step further with the Cultural Development Foundation set to present Music Celebration of Our Musicians featuring the Ashanti to be held on Saturday, November 23rd at the National Cultural Center from 8.30 p.m. Steven, what you say? Big up Steven in the house. To my house. 